I'm Joshua Farnsworth and welcome to my workshop. I'm out here on the stoop uh, just to give you a little demonstration of how I create uh, historical looking slotted screws uh, instead of having to try to hunt down some old fashioned slotted screws for your historical pro projects like these old hinges wouldn't, leak, wouldn't look very good with uh, zinc plated slotted screws which is pretty much all you can find. Um, there's, <laughs> there's some places that claim to be selling the uh, old new stock slotted screws that look more historical, but I think they're probably doing what I do. I've tried a few different methods. I've tried uh, putting putting them <laughs> putting them in the fire. I've tried blowtorch. Uh, th those both work, but they don't look quite as as good. There's residue left on. So the the uh, what I found that works the best is to take this stuff that works. I've heard a couple people talk about it, and so that's what I use. Uh, and you put these zinc plated screws. I put them in a glass jar, and this is super easy. And I try to not mix up my size screws uh, so I can keep a track of them, but you can put them all in if you want. This stuff is pretty uh, toxic, so I would highly recommend that you put on some gloves. And if you think you're going to be splashing, I'd probably put on some safety glasses as well. Get these on. All right, finally figured out how to, how to put rubber gloves on. So this stuff, the works. Uh, this is this a new bottle? There you go. I guess I've got a, a half full bottle somewhere else. And all you do is you just pour enough in there to cover your screws. And I was surprised by how fast this actually works. Um, I would say leave it in there. You can you can stick a spoon or something in. Well, probably not a spoon. You can stick something in there to see when it's ready, or you can just look on the bottom. I think it usually takes me about five or ten minutes to do. Uh, so I'll come back and we'll we'll uh, dilute the water and pour it out and have a look at the screws. <sighs> okay, careful when you're shooting this to use a low low pressure. I'm doing this outside so that. Uh, I guess you could do it in a sink inside your house if you really wanted to. It's toilet bowl cleaner, so it'll probably clean your pipes. But um, it's a nice day today. I figured I'd do it outside. So I just run water in it until all the toilet bowl cleaner is diluted out. And it shouldn't hurt your grass if you dilute it enough. You could run more water on there if you wanted. So I'll just keep doing this looks like it's almost diluted and we'll pull them out and have a look at what we got it's only been about five minutes or so all right it's five minutes and and uh look what we got got them all out of there so you can see it totally stripped off all that zinc plating and we got some really nice looking historical style straight slotted screws. This is Joshua Farnsworth. If you're interested in learning traditional woodworking with hand tools, visit my website at woodandshop.com where you can find free video tutorials, workshop tours of amazing traditional woodworkers, and tool buying guides. You can ask questions and share your projects with thousands of woodworkers on my free traditional woodworking forum. Make sure you subscribe to my regular blog posts and also check out my 10 steps for getting started in traditional woodworking. Enjoy!